friends in kindergarten distance learning land. This week, we're talking about the letter Z. Z says Z. Can you hear that sound in the word zipper? Yes, it's right at the beginning of the word zipper. Right here is capital Z. And this is lowercase z. Now, z can say z by itself. Z also says z if it's at the end of a word and there are two z's together like the word buzz. And down here, s can actually make the Z sound too. We can hear it in our sight word is. Do you hear that Z sound in there? But it's not a Z. It's an S, even though it sounds like a Z. This is our Z rhyme. I'm going to read it to you. See the zipping zebra in the zoo? Zigging and zagging just for you. Can you zig and zag like a zebra too? Zig and zag is what you do. Let's look for the Z words in this rhyme. Here's one, zipping. And here's one, zebra. And over here, zoo. And there's zigging and zagging. And down here we have zig and zag. And there's our word zebra again. And there's zig and zag again. Look, they used a period for this first sentence and a period for this second sentence and a question mark here, and there is our exclamation point. And I made sure we had capitals at the beginning of each of our sentences. Let's say our rhyme once again. See the zipping zebra in the zoo? Zigging and zagging just for you. Can you zig and zag like a zebra too? Zig and zag is what you do. Let's review our sight words that we've gone over during distance learning. The first one is here, H-E-R-E. -E. The next one is R, A-R-E. -E. Then we had has, H-A-S. And then we had have, H-A-V-E. Next was for, F-O-R. Last week, we reviewed come, C-O-M-E. And this week, we're going to learn the word this. This is spelled T-H-I-S. Spell it with me. T-H-I-S. Let's sing a song so that you remember how to spell this. T-H-I-S. This. Oh, this is spelled T-H-I-S. Oh, this is spelled T-H-I-S. This dog made a stinky mess. This dog made a stinky mess. Oh, this is spelled T-H-I-S. Oh, this is spelled T-H-I-S. Oh, this is spelled T-H-I-S. This dog made a stinky mess. 
This dog made a stinky mess. Oh, this is spelled T H I S. Peanut and I want to talk to you about patience. Patience means being able to wait. It is having self control and being able to stick with something until it's done. What would patience look like if a parent was late to pick you up? Or if you wanted to grow a vegetable garden? Think about patience this week and we'll talk about it during our virtual circle time.